this strange error can stop you from using your favorite Windows apps. So if you're also having the same problem, here's how to get rid of it. Firstly, fix it by running a system file scan. Do it by opening command prompt with admin rights. Run the following command one by one and wait for it to detect the problem. You should also disable non-essential startup programs by opening Task Manager, click Startup tab, identify the unnecessary applications, then right-click on them, choose Disable from the context menu, then exit and restart your computer. Try also to re-register DLL files by opening CMD with admin rights. Type in the following command, and then press Enter to execute it. Once done, a prompt should pop up confirming the action has been completed. But for your last fix, resolve the issue by creating a new account. To do so, search for User Accounts, then select Add Account to create a new one. So that's how to fix the No Such Interface Supported error in your Windows computer. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.